good noon will time to mirror. It's twelve thirty PM. We gotta get my grandma yesterday. The offer of the day, yeah, I told you the boss cut my hours because the other dishwasher works now. He has three dishwashers. So the other guy, he works like four days a week now. I work like three days a week now. The other dishwasher works two days. But the other dishwasher has a job, another job. That's why I'm going to apply to the Casa Greek. Hopefully I get the job. I work there part time. Save up money and get my bike. Get my first year girlfriend. I don't hate you, i saying, yeah. You take your walk yesterday? Yeah, I took my walk. I took my walk at like 2 in the morning. Today, right? Not yesterday, today. You watch my video when I talk about Sky Source. And Zane is all that stuff right there. Although Zane's actors are lucky, obviously. First person doesn't pay me in the movie. All the other actors are left behind. Yeah. Looking at demons, guys. Demons. How scary. So scary, you guys might cry. For me, that's how scary the demons are. Yeah. Powerful story. I almost cried in Return of the King when Sam said, I can't carry it for you, I can carry you. He said, Come on, and he listened to love. I almost shed tears, man. When he talked about when, when Pearl destroyed the ring and they were, they were talking about the, the. He was talking about how he wants to marry Rosie and all that stuff. I almost cried, man. I didn't cry, but I almost shed a tear. If Lord of the Rings could move me like that, you can only imagine a movie like Zanus with Eric and them being demons. Passion of Christ, I almost cried too when I first watched it. It was disturbing, yeah. And Eric will make all, all these movies look good now. He'll make all these movies look good. Really? Yeah, make it all look good, man. Peter's not stupid. He knows. He read my book, obviously. He's not stupid. He knows. Yeah. So Ivan puts a puts two hundred million towards his vision for each volume. And all this money towards the sets, the cameras, and all that stuff. And you have Eric that looks like two, three times scared in this picture here. 
The only thing I wrote them on the beating is a woeful fill for the for, for, for him and the actors. And what? And it'll be a better movie than Lord of the Rings, yeah. <laughs> be better than the Rings, guys. You might not tell me that. Because Peter has an ego, obviously, but he's not stupid, man. He knows. He read my book. He's like, yeah. This is a pretty short one, though. Yeah. Whereby you have 5,000 stockings exiting, uh, uh, exiting the city. The Lord of the Rings, they had an exodus, too, in two towers, but it was only, like, I don't know, a couple hundred people from Rohan. Because Hobbit can't afford to 5,000 extras. Yeah, please, Ivan, we just couldn't afford this for Lord of the Rings. Don't tell me that. We just couldn't afford this for Lord of the Rings, Ivan. Yeah, you'll tell me, I, we couldn't afford this for Lord of the Rings. We couldn't afford this, Ivan. Yeah, you'll tell me that. You, Jackson. It's all shock. Ivan, you want, you, you want, like, you want to, you're putting this money towards sets, so towards your cameras, and your mask, and all that stuff. Yeah. It's like, holy shit. I have Lord of the Rings, we only put like 35 million towards uh, visual effects. <laughs> you got a world like that. You're putting how much towards each volume alone? Like 200 million plus, 203 million. It's like, holy shit. Like two, 200 million towards like one volume alone or like all three movies? No, no, one. I have like 200 million towards the, your, the three movies is already good enough. And you're putting that towards each volume? So 600 million towards visual effects? It's like, yeah, it's like, holy shit. Looking at an amazing movie. Ivan, we can afford whatever we want to do with this movie, Ivan. We can afford to do whatever we want. The movie. Yeah, man. I gave you all of the resources. Some Sarah. I gave Peter all of the resources. Yeah, that's why he's lucky. Or Mel Gibson. I might choose Mel over him. Some Sarah. Excuse the noise earlier. I was eating food. Leftovers from Christmas, right? I still have my Christmas leftovers. I'm eating leftovers. Today's my cheat day. I'm probably going to get maybe McDonald's or something. I don't know. McDonald's, I don't know. But tomorrow I most likely work. Or I might just work the Saturday Sunday. Week. I don't know. That's why I'm going to apply to the Casa Group today. I'm going to apply there. Hopefully I get the job. You want full-time hours or part-time? I'm in part-time. I already have part-time hours in my other job. The gatekeepers will never let me work full-time there. And then like four days a week, I don't really want, they won't let me make that money. What's the max money they'll let you make? Maybe 1100 max is the max they'll let me make. 1050 1080 1100 is the max they'll let me make. We don't, we, we'll never let Ivan make over 30k a year. He, he, he can make his 24,000, but not 30k. So crazy people, yeah. How do I know that? Because when I applied for Mopify, they were willing to pay me 19 an hour, and they, they cut my hours like twice a week. Because 19 hours above minimum wage. Whereas minimum wage will let me work full time hours because they know I'll make like my $1,000. 911, 1060, they'll let me make that. That's enough money for me to save money for my bike. I'm sidetracking, you know. I'm sorry. So how do you distribute movie, Ivan? Two choices. Either I sell online like I have something like Netflix and I stream it online or I sign with Amazon those are my two options obviously how much money would you, would you make more money signing with Amazon or online stream I'll make about the same thing because 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 I'm doing the math yes Amazon's taking 20% but I'm pricing the series for like a hundred like ten dollars so it's a big profit margin 
Whereas online, I'll price it for $30. I'm not, dis I'm not, I'm not, what, splitting my money with anyone else. I take way more of the royalties. But because it's a lower price, you, I'll probably make about the same thing as I made for the, uh, sign with Amazon. Can you guys see my point here? Yeah, I'm seeing your point, yeah. But I will be uh, partnering with Amazon. As 4K Blue is better than online streaming, right? Than streaming, right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a 4K Blue and sell it on 4K Blu-ray. Which is a lot of work for Amazon, but they can handle it, obviously. I am like, why would you want to go through that hassle of delivering all your movies? I'm like, I know the cons is delivering the movies, but you're going to get a better experience at home. 4K Blu-ray is better than streaming. And you get the nice box set that you get to own, man. Yeah. I might have a steel box set. The steel metal box set, I might do that. But, uh, but the, the cardboard one's fine. It just depends on, 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 on yeah. Still, the steel one's probably more expensive, but you're looking at a beautiful box set. Remember that Godfather box set I showed you, like, last year? I have a nice box like that. The three volumes are in there. You know, that's it. It's beautiful. Holy shit, it's, this box set's beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful. The three volumes come in the box set. Yeah, those are nice. For the movie. And then I'm selling nice merch, too, for Zanus. Yeah, nice fucking merch. Sarah. After this, I'm going to go to the store and get my ring smokes. I'm going to ask my, uh, the folks to drive me there because they know, they know the boss very well. There's a better chance of uh, me going with them. You know, I'll, I'll have a higher chance of getting a job. I'll just get that money, money, man. Like I'm poor. $600 is not going to cut it. $500, bucks, 600 bucks is not enough for me to save money for the bike money. It's not enough, man. I have bills to pay. I have to pay off over in Quebec. Which I'm doing today, I have to pay them off today, obviously. And, uh, I have to what? Pay my phone bill, my insurance, and I now have to pay for my medication too, right? I'm no longer covered for medication. Medication will cost me, I don't know, 80 bucks, 100 bucks, yeah. For all my medication, right? Yeah. So what's your plan, Ivan? My plan is the money I make off... Um, Casa Greek, I save that. The money I make off Google 40, I blow it. So if I make my 580, 600, 650, 700 bucks, 600 bucks working on Google 40, that I blow. And the 450 bucks or whatever I make part-time working at... Uh, that's a Greek. I save that money. That's how it works. I bought myself a nice motorcycle jacket and nice motorcycle boots, winter boots. Black boots are fucking nice. It cost me 165 bucks. I ordered it on Amazon yesterday. I use some of my Christmas money to, to get my jacket and my boots. I got a couple hundred bucks for Christmas this year. I got a lot of money then. I was shocked. <laughs> and I used the majority of it, a good chunk of it, to get the jacket and the shoes. And the rest, I spent it on beer and smokes and kind of stuff, yeah. Drinks and yeah. Yeah, hence why what? Zane's will be a masterpiece. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it'll be a masterpiece, man. A 
masterpiece. You guys will see what I mean when you read the book, man. You're looking at an amazing movie. An amazing book, sorry. And the adaption will be amazing, too. Because if you tell that kind of story, looking at a, you know, a masterpiece. <laughs> I hope Peter and Mel are going to really fight hard for that job, man. It's going to be crazy. They're going to really compete. Really, Ivan, yeah, they're going to really compete hard for that job. Peter Jackson and uh, Mel Gibson. They're going to really compete hard for that job, yeah. PR for that job. Peter Jackson and Mel Gibson. They're gonna be hard. They're gonna be hard for that job, yeah man. And whoever comes with a better ant test until I try to choose. Obviously. That's the director I choose. That's the director I choose. Yeah. So Peter all paying his six hundred million Canadian deal, which is seven forty five million years old in the old days. Mel all paying is like three twenty five million, whatever it is, three thirty million, which is like two hours um, seventy million American deal. And he's supposed to sign a master contract, obviously. Peter's like, I want about double that. I'm like, no, Peter, I'm not paying you double. You're fucking greedy. You're a greedy pig, man. Peter is a greedy animal, he's greedy, man. Greedy pig. I'm sorry. I wonder what all that, I want all that. I feed like, Peter, no, I'm not paying you double, you're fucking greedy. If I make seven billion off the book, I'm not gonna, I'm probably gonna make around that range of the movie after taxes, I'm not gonna pay you $8 billion of the gold because you're fucking greedy. Four hundred million dollars is enough, that's $500 million of your own money. It's a massive contract, you just double you make Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings, you make 250, this, this, this you make double, 500. <laughs> You also have your 100 million base on your merch. You're making 145 million dollars for your merch. This is more than what you made for the guy. Yeah, this is more than what you made for the rings. Yeah, it's more than what you made for the rings, Peter. You're just greedy. You're a greedy pig, yeah. You're the greedy animal. Even though Peter Jackson's contract is peanuts compared to how much I'm making, it's just, it's just like pocket change. Not really pocket change. It's a good chunk of my money, but it's a couple, like a few percent of my money. But compared to how much the actors are making, he, the, the, like the, his contract blows their contract out of the water. Peter Jackson's contract. Yeah. All these actors are making peanuts on how much he makes. He's making his, like, his $425 million. And like 100 million for the base and like 9 million for the merch. Peter Jackson signed a massive deal. And all these Hollywood actors are making like little, little, little peanuts for how much Peter makes. Yeah. Because he's greedy, he's buying by his greedy. He wants more money, obviously. So you might try, Ivan, what about like 600 million of the, of the, of the box office? I'm like, no. What? I bet you's enough. I'm not going to give you, Peter, like a good chunk of my money, man. You're fucking crazy, man. He might push for double, and if not, he'll push for maybe 550, 600. What about 700 million Ivan, 650 million of them? Because he wants his like 800, 900 million deal, right? He's a greedy pig. I'm like, Peter, no. Like, but I invested. Ivan, you're going to make your money back off your game royalties and your, and your merch royalties and, and your box office royalties. You're going to make all your money back. I know, Peter, but I want to recoup my investment. I'm not giving you any more money, man. As you wouldn't give me this deal. Yeah, there you go. Yo, I, mean, I would never pay you four hundred dollars. I give you like, 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 like twenty five million. That's it. And I'm like, yeah, because you're fucking greedy, Peter. You're cheap and greedy. And I am giving you 
for $25 million of the royalties of the movie. You look generous. And that's not enough for you, Ivan. I want more, man. I'm like, Peter, I'm not giving you more. You're fucking greedy. I'm a greedy pig. Yeah. And if I sense that he's angry, I'm like, look, man, if you're angry and you're not happy with his offer, I'm more than happy to choose Mel over you and you'll be, you'll be left behind making less money and working your share budget in Hollywood. This is the lie, man. Yeah. This is more than what I made for the rings. Yeah, it's more than what Bob Shea and Michael Lynn paid you for the rings. They pay you 10 for your base. I'm paying you 100 in using your Zealand money. And I'm giving you $425 million in rollies, which is like $500 million. That's a lot of money for the box office. And $90 million for the merch, which is like $100 and like almost $50 million. In rollies, that's a rich contract. You're just greedy. Yeah, that's a good deal for me, Ivan. Like, this is more than what I'm going to bring. Yeah. Ivan, what about the game? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Are you going to give Peter a piece of that? I'm like, no, he's not getting a piece of the game. Peter's not getting a piece of the game. Cool, sir. Yeah. The reason why I'm not giving him a piece of the game is because he's not involved in the game. Yes, he's building my empire, but he's not building He's not building the game empire. Peter has no involvement in the game whatsoever. That's why I'm not giving him a shit for the game. Sir, he might want a nice $50 million of that. I what about a nice like $40 million of that at the game? Because he wants to make as much money as he can. I'm like, no, I'm not giving you money for the game. The Lord of the Rings, they may have given you money for the game, even though you had no involvement in the game. For Zane, you're not getting a piece of the game. Just the movie and merch. That's it. You don't get any money for the game. I'm sorry. What will do the least in sales, Ivan? The game. The game won't do that much because most people in the world don't play games, right? Yeah. Oh, I heard only like ten percent of people in the world play games. Like the game, the game business is not that big of a market. Obviously, the games make money because they're very they're more expensive than movies. And that's why they make a lot of money. But my game will do maybe a few billion. Four sixty million dollar investment. It does a few billion dollars. My game, maybe three billion, four billion, maybe three billion. It's a lot of money. Make profit. A couple billion will do. And I only do maybe even two billion. Yeah, but two billion dollars in a four sixty million dollar investment is a good investment. I make my money back. The game I only do maybe one point seven billion, one point five two billion. The game will do. That's why I'm not giving Peter a piece of the game. The merch is going to sell quite a lot. And almost as much as the movie, or if not more, perhaps. I don't know. But Usually, the companies make more money on merch than they do the movies. But for my company, I think I'll make more on, off my movie than the merch. It's the Ivan movie. And not everyone will buy my merch. And not everyone will buy my game. Because Rabbit is my walkthrough guy, not everyone will buy the game. Most people are probably going to watch this walkthrough. And, and, and only a small percentage of people buy the game. How much people? I don't know. Maybe, maybe seventy million people around the world buy the game, and everyone else watches it by walkthrough. It's there. So I make a, a, a maybe one point eight billion off 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 the game, two billion off the game, two point five million dollars off the game, or something like that. I made I made my money back. Four system on investment, two point five million dollars. I I made my money back. Obviously, it's a good investment. Obviously. And the merch, I don't know how much I make off that. I'll make a couple billion off that too. And the movie, I'll make a lot of money off that too. Well, you know how much money you'll make off your movie? Yes. I'll know how much money I make off my movie based on how much money I make off my book. If I make $7 billion off the book, chances are I'll make around that range for the movie. Maybe a bit more. Maybe nine, eight, eight billion, nine billion after taxes I make off the movie. That's what I'm saying. The movie does $17 million in the box office. $17 million is pay taxes and split with SkySource and, 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 and Amazon. Obviously, some sir. If the movie does $17 billion in the box office, after taxes, that's like $10.8 billion. billion. And it's seven, I, I, I pull in a good $6 billion something. And $6.9 billion, Amazon pulls in three billion, three, three, two point eight billion or something like that. And I pull in 7.2. Yeah, it's good good money. I made my money back, obviously. I invested one point two billion dollars towards the movie. I made 7 billion bucks. That's a good investment. And that's why you have to be careful, man. If if you make 
seven billion off your book, Ivan. Don't give Peter eight fifty million dollars. You're being stupid with your money, as you might only make seven billion. And if you make seven billion, you don't want to give Peter a billion dollars left by then. He's a greedy pig, Peter. Yeah, he's greedy, man. I'm like Peter, no, I'm not paying him for money. He's a greedy pig. Yeah. Honestly, or I might make something crazy like twenty billion off the book. I'm shocked, and I I make that for the movie too. See, if you make that, you can give Peter's eight fifty million deal, obviously. But even four point five million is enough. You don't have to give him that, man. It's enough. I'm, I'm, I'm chances are I might even do that. Just, but what I'm paying is enough. He doesn't make that in Hollywood, man. I don't want him duping like that, too, Sarah. So we say, all right, well, she's just saying yes. Sir. Buy will everyone buy the merch? No, not everyone will buy the merch. Not everyone will buy the merch because 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 some people can't afford it and, and no one really cares that much about merch, right? No no no. People care about merch, but like no one not everyone will buy it. Maybe Maybe two hundred million people around will buy them. Two fifty million people around will buy a merch around there. It's not everyone will buy it. Uh, yeah, it's nice to have a poster, but I don't feel like paying. I don't feel like paying two hundred bucks for the frame posters. Fuck it, they don't buy the merch. But some people who are crazy fans, they buy the merch. Obviously, that's what I'm saying. Whereas the movie, everyone will buy that. All the families and the, the English speaking families around will buy it. I don't know, 600 million copies sold in the 4K Blu-ray, something crazy like that. 600 million copies sold, yeah. And then the 28% and 72% split for Ivan and Amazon. I'm not, not going to say Scarces because when I, when, when I signed that contract with Amazon, when I signed that contract with Amazon, obviously, I'm going to say in the contract the money goes to, to, to the to, to the two recipients who own the company. Don't say it goes to Scott's Entertainment. Don't do that. Otherwise, the government can come after you. And and, 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 and and the government can come after you, obviously. And they can see that as business money, not personal money. If they see that as business money, they'll be like, okay, Ivan paid his business tax, but he didn't pay his personal tax. They can tax you twice. Because you have something called business tax and personal tax. I don't like shit, obviously. Hence why Rob May Burnett took that video down with Paul Jenkins. He took it down. Because I think he's scared of Paul Jenkins coming after him. And the government coming after him. Because in, 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 in that what? In that he I probably opened his eyes. Holy shit. Ivan's right. Yeah. When, 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 when Paul. When Paul. When, 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 when Rob worked for Paul Jenkins obviously. He, he, he put. He, he, Paul Jenkins paid him in his business account. I'm like, yeah, Rob, that's why he went after you, man. Because you, you, you pay you in your business account, man. He can see that as a loan. He can see that as, 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 as business money, not your personal money. That's why he thinks you own money. Because you, you, you have people pay you through your business account. Why would you do that? No, have them pay you through your personal account. That way you don't have to worry about them coming after you. Obviously. Because Paul Jenkins obviously sees that money as, his, as, as, as Rob's business money. Not his personal money. That's why he went after him. He, he owes me money. He stole money from me because he sees it as a loan because it's his business money. Yeah. That's Rob's mistake that he made, obviously. And he took the video down with Paul Jenkins. He took, I don't know why he took it down. He probably wanted to protect himself. He, he doesn't want Paul Jenkins coming after him and the government coming after him for taxes. Or, and so that's why he took the video down. But I feel bad for Paul Jenkins. He had a, a, a GoFundMe and and, and Rob took it down, man. You know what I'm saying? 
I don't know why he did that, but he took that video down. No, I think he's scared of Paul Jenkins coming after him, maybe. Not Paul Jenkins. Not Paul Jenkins coming after him. The, the guy in the, in the video coming after him. Not Paul Jenkins. I said Paul Jenkins in the video. No. He's scared of the guy who, who sued Paul Jenkins. He's scared of him coming. Who he worked for. He's scared of that guy coming after him. That's why he took the video down. Probably, probably to protect himself. Or he thinks it's BS. I don't know, man. So. Ivan, you're smart. You know your shit. Yes. You say in a contract, the money goes to the two recipients, obviously. And the government will see that as, oh, yeah, that's, that's, Ivan, that's Ivan's personal money. He already paid his taxes. Amazon will, will, will most of Amazon, you, go, you, guys, you guys will pay the tax first, right? Yeah, Ivan, we'll do the taxes for you before we get our money. Yeah, before we get our money, do the taxes first. That tax that I paid, that's my personal tax because that, the money that I'm making is my personal money. Was if you say Sky Source, the government will see that as business tax. You know, Ivan paid his business tax, but he didn't pay his personal tax, and they might tax you twice. If they tax you twice, they're taking a shitload of your money, man. A lot of your money. You, know, I only make maybe three billion bucks or something like that. I'm pissed off. I made only like a, a two billion in profit, and the, the, the government took a couple billion dollars more of my money. Yeah, you have to be careful, Sarah. Say it goes for Peter or Mel. I'm like, I'm like, Peter, I recommend when I pay you, don't don't associate your wooden up production company for your payments. Otherwise, the, the New Zealand government can come after you and they can tax you twice. They see this business tax. No, I mean, yeah, bring your personal, what, direct deposit bank phone. Don't bring your business stuff, man. Bring your personal direct deposit bank phone. That way I pay you in your personal money. The money goes to your personal accounts. I'm sorry. Huh? Sure, I can't remember. 